The previous was heavily back, burned the box and got the money. And this one here, Halley's Girl's been well backed. Set to run. Lights on for the third. This is the Tab Corp Juvenile. They're ready. Racing. Flying Clarice began well. Can't quite clear them at this stage. Now it does. Billman's Burglar can't hold it. And there was trouble there coming down Billman's Burglar. And Flying Clarice was left six or seven in front. Halley's Girl second. Third, Corborn Jumpy. A gap then to Roped In and Spring Vader's out the back. And a big gap to the other one that tumbled. I refer to Billman's Burglar, but Flying Clarice is going to bolt in. She won by four. Halley's Girl second. Third, Corborn Jumpy. So it's a Rasmussen trifecta, if you don't mind. He's having a day out, the Rasmussen team. Then came behind them Spring Vader, roped in, and the last one will be Billman's Burglar, but it failed to complete the course. So Flying Clarice wins for Tony Rasmussen, and the Rasmussen trifecta there for Tony. So number four leads all the way, defeats the seven. The five will be third, and the times here we await upon. 5.20, the early split, 22 and 65 the time. For the winner, Flying Clarice. She was eventually able to push down and lead. Billman's Burglar copped a check and he was uh, pushed out the back and failed to complete the course. Seven second, Halley's Girl. Number five, Corborn Jumpy gets third. Number eight, fourth, Spring Vader. So Tony with the trifecta there. 22.65 the time. Four, seven, five and eight. So Tony with a double. Lisa with a winner. And they go around again in race four. Tony and Lisa both with a runner each. Uh, we await the all clear here on the third, four, seven, five and eight.